Yeah, so we're on our way to go um, deal with some of our rental units right now. Um, the tenant just moved out recently, and he kind of left us a, a little bit of, of a little bit of a surprise. A little um, bit of a pest. You'll surprise? probably see it in the title, but uh, it's going to be quite interesting. Um, yeah. So. Yes. Yeah, stay tuned to see what it is, and um, in all of its glory. It's going to be great. Definitely what I want to be doing on a Saturday definitely what I'm doing on a weekend on a Saturday. So yeah. yes sir. Alright, so we're out here in the hood. You already know what it is, man. Uh we got some things right here with us. Uh we're gonna go do some right, right quick. This is one of our units right here. We have a friend right here. I call him Spidey. Peter Parker. We starting with all the little bags right here. Here we go. So that's why I brought this guy. Yes, sir. We can kill everything. Hey, let me get the keys. So something to be cautious about is when we open up this door, there's gonna be a cockroaches up here and they're, they're gonna fall down on us. So what you got to do, All right, you ready for Y'all watch this, bro. Watch. <laughs> yes, sir. That's what we got right here. And you already, you can tell. Yeah. We haven't even gotten inside yet. They're all around, you see this shit. You see it. All right, let's get inside. All right, then come inside. Bring it, bring it, bring it. those things in. Real quick, go inside. Yup, every single time. Y'all little motherfuckers going, man. Yeah, on the walls and shit, running all around. Open, open this one, plug shit in. We're gonna kill all these motherfuckers, bro. All these little motherfuckers right here, we're gonna kill them all. Yup. You guys. You, 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 you. Where y'all at, huh? Zoom in on this. Shit. The so now he's squirming this shit, right? Um. So what? So what this does is it doesn't kill him immediately. It's like a slow-acting poison, but. Um, but it will, it will like kill them over time. So it lets, it gives them time. It like gives, it gives them time to go like hang out with each other, mate with each other and shit. Um, and then they spread the poison to each other. And that will kill them over time. It also prevents them from reproducing. So we're just gonna keep spraying. Like you see, we see these guys here, here, here. So adios, adios, adios. Where do y'all think you going, bro? You think I'm really playing right now? Nah. Uh-uh. Nobody's playing with you. Yo. Yeah. I'm really old. Oh, uh, look at this big ass right here. Bye-bye. Yeah, where you going? Oh, y'all, yeah, bro. Oh, y'all. Yeah. On the door. On the door. Where? On the door. Don't even Play with me, bro. You think so? Right there. Come, come here, come here. Zoom in on this two X's mode, bro. All right. Adios. Yes. You see all these guys right here? So the white stuff I put is boric acid. They hate this. Like this shit will kill them over, over time too. Like they hate this shit. Here's a little baby one right here. All right, so let's, uh, I'm turning the light. Let's go in the kitchen. So, you can see, you can see, so I just go all the way over here. This is 
fucking graveyard right here. Pan all around. All the, all the way in there. In here. You see all of these dead ass fuckers right here, man. Y'all really think this is a joke? It ain't no joke, bro. We really out here living our best life. I just really like this, bro. Look at this Every f***ing where. So, so come here. You can see there's a little baby one right here. Real close. F*** you. And they like to be in these little door hinges, so let's just... Spray all up in there. All up in the door hinges. You can see, see? Little baby ones all over the place right here. All up in the door hinges. It's under the door, like, it, there's one like crawling up on the side of the door. Where? Right here? No, 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 like right there. You see it? There you got it. Okay. Yeah, I see all the, the another baby, baby one right here. And then another one, they all, they all just running everywhere. Whoops. That's a little too strong. Just make sure I get that guy. Okay, and then come through here. So you can see this guy. All those, those are their droppings. So go, go up real close there. That's how you can tell that this, this place has been infested for a long ass time. That's not natural. Alright, see? Another one of those. You. Oh, it's dead. It's dead. Damn. Yep. So, as you can see, like, it's not that easy out here, bro. We really out here trying to get it, but then, you know, we got the little pets trying to keep us down. We just have to keep grinding and stay up, you feel me? That's how we do it. So, after we're done with the bengal, um, we're gonna get this uh, the gel bait. Oh, no. Are you dead? He's dead. He's dead. Oh, on the wall. He's not dead. Okay. So we're gonna use this. Uh... Oh, okay. look how gross my hands are. I'm gonna I'm gonna stop touching my phone. Yeah. It's disgusting. But we're gonna use this gel bait. It's probably the best thing. So it's like the it's like the bait version of this guy. So it's they're gonna eat it. They're gonna spread it to their friends, and it's also gonna stunt their growth. So. We're gonna just put it in like high profile areas. So should we put it in the door hinges? Yeah. So like, uh, typically, like cockro so cockroaches, they need like food, water, and shelter. So that's why they like hang out in the kitchen area. But actually, uh, we called the exterminator and we put most of the ones in the kitchen. From, from what I see, this one right here. Um, But, uh, yeah, there's, it's a lot in the water, water heater. The most I've seen right now is over by the door. So we just took care of that area. So, so what does it mean when they're like by the door? Or is that just like one of the places where they like to hang out? So like, I don't know why they're by the door. Cause usually like you can see like through all like the, there's so many dead bodies in the in, in, in the, the kitchen, kitchen. and usually and they're not by like this the like bedroom doors yeah, either. Yeah, because there's like no food in the bedroom and there's no food uh, out there. So maybe like they're neat, so, since the old tenants moved out, there's no more food or water in the kitchen. They moved over outside um, because now there's more food outside or something or close to the door. But they have they can't survive outside. They have to stay indoors though. So like cockroaches are like they're only a human. They're human pets. We brought them. They can't live without us. They do not exist naturally in nature. So what we're gonna do is we're just gonna put little bits. Uh, just oh, that's so gross. So you can look in, look in here. It's all of their droppings, dude. They've been here for a long time. But what if I just drop your phone in the couch? So yeah, we're just gonna just put a little bit. Do you need to twist it off? I need to twist it off. Yep. So we're just gonna put a little bit everywhere. Oh, yeah. 
So I, that's actually too much. Um, I want to put less. Yeah, just. I feel like the kitchen's not really a big problem area right now, though. Nah, they're hiding. They're definitely hiding. So I'm just gonna put dabs everywhere. Um, you don't want to put like a straight line, cause then they know. They, no, they won't eat it. I mean, they'll eat it, but you're just wasting. So just put a little dab everywhere. I need to work on my technique. I'm very slow, but okay. So that should be okay. Let's see if they're in here. Maybe don't do that. That's just broken. Again, my technique is really bad, but. No, don't do it like that. Keep it horizontal, dude. Okay. Last time the exterminator did it like along the sill, like the window sill, or not the window sill, but like between the counter and the wall. Oh, 100%. So what we have to do also, here, we'll take a break from doing this, because we have to, um, we're going to have to move the fridge out. So I anticipate there's going to, I think there's going to be a lot uh, behind the fridge. There's going to be so many behind the fridge. You already look up here? No, not yet. You can zoom in. Oh, that's the boric acid? Well, that's the boric acid, but look at all, they're behind the boric. Look at all the... Oh, it's kind of hard to see because it kind of... Oh, that's the graveyard, bro. Yeah, here, I got it, I got it. Some graveyard up here. This is where they like to be. side too on the right hand side I'll move the fridge first All right, so let's move the fridge yep let's see it yo what the fuck? yeah zoom in on that what the f bro? Yep. So, let me get in here. That's just how it be, man. Let me move it out some more so you can see. Oh, that's as far as it's gonna move out. This guy's running away. Bro, do you see this? This yeah. is a f massacre. Yep, yeah, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. And there's, um, I mean, there's still some out there though. So you can see there's like little ones running around. So I think the exterminator, we got them the first time. But we gotta be sure to get the babies. You know what, they're um, probably all up in the fridge too, like inside the... Yeah, so I actually need to remove this wire because uh, you gotta get inside. There's no, there's no question we need to get inside this fridge. So. For what? Even on the tape. Fold it in half and then close it out. Do they tape it up so they, the cockroaches won't get into the outlet? I have no idea. I feel like that might be it. You see, they got they got all that tape on the... Oh uh, yeah, there's a lot of them in the outlet. 
Yeah, so that's probably, probably why they take it up, bro. It's kind of hard to get in here. Like, you see it? Yeah. Are you able to see it? I'm able to see the outlet. Yeah, right there's here. a lot of them in here. Let me take this. And there's like. There's some, there's even some live ones, like, they were running on my hand. Gross. So I think we know where they're coming from now. What, the outlet? Yeah. You see that he's kind of elongated? So mm -hmm. it means he's carrying an egg sac. So he can, once he breeds. So it's a female? Or she, I don't care. But like, once she breeds, be like 30 or 40 more of these and you can see, like I told you, all the droppings, the same thing as in the door, you already know they've been living here for a while. And I guess the tenants knew about it too, they taped it up and like everything like that. Yeah. I hope that doesn't fuck up the electrical. I really don't care, bro. Yeah, so we, we'll probably need to come back and open this up. So there's a little, there's a flathead screwdriver. We can maybe open up with a coin. I should have brought the other car. Should we um put baits around the, gel baits around the Oh, 100%. Thing? Yeah. All right, let's put baits. So a lot of these things, I came here earlier. I had to wait. I had to wait for these guys to come in the mail because a lot of the ones they have at Home Depot and Lowe's, like um, like these liquid baits, they don't do. Like, don't waste your money on stupid stuff. Pay a little bit more and get some good quality, premium. So I'm just gonna put dab around this outlet. You can. You already know that this outlet. All right, so that's good. And let's, um, we're honestly just gonna line up here. So we're able to just go in, um, spray, bait, fumigate, whatever we need to do. Good. I know there's hell of them up here. Yep. There it is. I can't see up there, but I know there's hell of them up there. Oh, not to mention there's all mold up here too. And you can see that they've been living <clears throat> they've been living in the light for a while. You need to angle it more, Bo. Yeah, I think you need to work on your technique, buddy. Shut up, buddy. Okay, so. Alright, so I put it all up there. We can put. Oh, here's one. Bye bye. Here's one right here, too. Oh, it just fell off the ground. The uh, poison is probably working. We probably sprayed some of them like three times already, a few times over. Needs getting better. That's. Then you can 
mountain view head is so gross. That's not as bad as I thought it would be. This? No, no. Bro, watch out. We're moving this out. It's gonna be pretty bad behind us. Yeah, I'm gonna smoke. Order that at the bar. Oh, yeah. I'm trying to run away right now. Let's go ahead and give 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 this a good panel. Where are y'all? Really I saw a couple of them running that way. You see that big ass mother? Of you. Yep. So spray them down and whatever, whatever we don't get, we'll hit them with the baits. Baby one right here. Okay. Let's hit them with the baits. I think. I'm being careful not to step on them because I want them to infect each other. And also, you don't want to step on them. Well, these guys, dude. They're just on top of my head. You want me to give your head a brushing? My hands are clean. No, I, I think I got it. Okay. Yeah, that's pretty gross. Okay. Here we are. So, I'm just gonna... Ah, I'm just gonna keep this... Go away. So, I'm just gonna keep this guy close to me then. So what's in this uh, this gel compound is like something like the food they really like. It's like giving candy to a baby, bro. Like it's, they cannot resist it, so they just eat it, and then they'll explode. Not actually explode. But... You can see on the stove right here. There are droppings all over the place. They've been here, like I said, for quite some time. Bro, stop running towards me. So I'm gonna also just Yeah. Yeah, so they probably built their little nest in there. Hell yeah. Pushing it out. Hell yeah, partner. <laughs> okay. I'm gonna line this whole wall. This seems to be the problem area. Right here. Fat ass. Nice. Give us a twerk. Sorry. <laughs> Hi. Well, this one out the door. Okay. The edge of this door. They're always like hanging out up top whenever you come in. For some reason, it makes me think they're trying to like get out go upstairs or something. Yeah. Damn, it's 
Sorry for me. Go. Is there any on my neck or are we being paranoid? Hmm? But is there one on my neck or are we being paranoid? Oh, there's one in the back. Hold on. Now it's on the ground. Yep. So you can't ever. <sighs> Deal with these guys like that. I'm gonna tuck your shirt into your underwear. Yeah, I should have done that. You're right. And then I'm gonna do that for me too. That's some of the fuck that was on your back. For real? Yeah, right there. Sorry, I wasn't being paranoid. Who's on your back? Zoom into this guy. This guy was literally crawling on my back, dude. If I brought that dude home, it'd be a wrap. Nice. All right, bathroom. So the bathroom's not terrible. I'm just gonna line some up. Um, I'm just gonna line some up up here on top, as you can see. All the little plugs right here, we don't have any dropping, so there's really no indication that they really live in here at all. So let's go ahead and just line it up. Loki, there's a big ass wall on your left. Where? On the wall. Look at how long this guy is. He's definitely carrying eggs. She. Do you have any last words to say? Adios. So why can't they flip over when they're on their backs? How are they gonna flip over? Huh? Look how short their legs are. Anatomically, they would not be able to do that. Alright, that should be good for this one. I'm not worried about this guy. Um, very much at all. Uh, I don't see droppings or anything. Yeah, you're dead. You can run. I don't care. Yeah. We can take a shower in there. No. Why not? This one's our third. Let's just line this up. They really like dark places like this. Even though there's none here, they might come here later, so. Let's just line it up. Yep. Yeah, here. So actually, it's really important that we strip before we get in the car, too. I actually didn't bring extra clothes, though. You didn't tell me to bring extra clothes. Yeah, I didn't think they were actually going to get on us, though, but like, they were getting on us. Yeah, now you're freaked out, huh? Yeah, I don't want to bring this shit home. Yeah, I know. I Day one of extermination. Um, there are some big ass around here. And we didn't really think they were in the bedroom, but it seems like there are a couple in there just hiding out. Um, if you walk in, you see a bunch of like dead ones on the ground, which is probably from like the last extermination, but just a couple here and there. All right, house number two. Hell yeah, buddy. Yeah, how, how, how many did you put? I put three. Hmm. You can see them right there. Little cuties right here. Look at this guy trying to squirm. <laughs> yeah. Uh, so I put one here too. Yeah, do you know so. the same way I so uh, before I buy more like looks black? They're, they're black? Uh-huh. Like, uh, like that. And this is... 
Okay. This one doesn't have any. Okay. Y'all, so as you can see, it was gross. I feel like I have little, little crawling all over me right probably, now. Probably right there. Ah. Uh, <laughs> yeah, see, so you can't really be bringing these little friends back to mama house. You feel me? So after we get home, we're gonna strip down before we get in, put everything in a little bag, throw it in the wash. Like, I'm really not trying to play with these little guys right now, bro, to be honest. Like, where do you think I'm gonna strip, bro? I don't care. Like, you can go in the back or something, but like, dude, if you bring even one home, it's game over. You're gonna have a whole problem in your hands, so. That's why a lot of people like to hire an exterminator and stuff, but like, it can get a little pricey, like, like I said, we did hire an exterminator and they got rid of maybe 90% of the problem. But the problem with these guys is it requires maintenance. Like you have to kill them and then you have to kill them again because they have like, um, there's gonna be eggs that you don't get to. So you have to just spray and kill for like three or four cycles before you can even eradicate a problem. And that's if you get lucky, so. Yeah, that being said, man, probably just grab some food real quick on our way home. <laughs> I don't think I can eat right now. Why not? I'm honestly so grossed out. Like, kind of lost my appetite. All right, then I'm going to grab some food on my way home. Liz, you going to watch me eat this, John, bro? It's just like, it's gross, but like, end of the day, it's just something we got to do. All right. But um, yeah, stay tuned for what happens next. We'll probably be back in a couple days. Yeah, for round two, round three, whatever. Yeah, however rounds, however many rounds it takes. Yeah, how it be, man. All right, we out.